Hey everyone, it's Andrea. Welcome back to the channel. I am going to be continuing um, the picture in Choir Girls Grayscale by a Ava Brown. Um, yeah, sorry, I'm just trying to get my camera straight. That's a bit better. So we were working on the mermaid. So we're going to carry on with the mermaid and finish her off um, today. And then we'll start something new next time. I don't know what. We'll have to decide. So how are we all? Are we all feeling good? I'm great, you know, I've been busy, I've been colouring, we've been obviously tidying up the house, but you know, because you have to. And I've been playing with Jennifer, we've been out in the garden, I've caught the sun again, which is never good, because I always end up, you know, a lot of pain with it, because it uh, itches and comes out in a rash, so that's not good. So I've ordered, well I, there will be a haul this month, I keep saying there's not going to be a haul because I'm not going to buy anything. And I've forgotten what colour was what now. I pulled all the colours but I can't remember which one was which. Uh, right, okay. That's fine, I don't know. thought I'd be organised and pull all the colours out. But now I can't remember which ones are which, so that's not good. Yeah, so there will be a haul. It's not as big as normal. But there are a few books, a few supplies, because of course I had yet another bonus this month from work. I still haven't spent it all, but that's fine, I don't have to spend it all at once. Which means there will probably be another haul next month. Um, I don't know yet. I'm thinking about getting, um, oh, the What's It ones. Sorry, there's stuff everywhere on this desk at the moment. I'm testing cameras to sell on eBay and I sit up here sometimes because I've got to change the batteries and I'm always afraid I'm going to lose the batteries if I don't keep them somewhere safe. <laughs> I've got my sticky notes around there. Oh dear, it's a right mess, I tell you. So there will be a haul. Um, I can't believe it. it's actually almost the end of the month going on. You know, we'll be all putting up our hauls and our stuff. It's, it's unreal. And then I've got my colour this is. I want to get a, a, a lighter one. 101. Or a darker one. Yeah, we can go with 100. Oh. You know, I can't believe it. It's that time of the month we will be filming our completed pages and hauls and, and doing all that again it's just gone so fast yeah I'll look at some of the pictures I did early in the month and I'll think oh my god it seems like years since I did that as always with me there's a lot of patterns because I do find the patterns really really relaxing to do so I do like to crack on with them um but Yeah, I've been watching videos, I'm still watching Finders Beepers History Seekers, I haven't finished watching all of them and they only put one up a week. Um, I've been watching Lightning Top, I'm working my way through theirs as well. And of course now I'll stop watching all that to get through all the, the colouring uh, hauls and pages. I do like to have a look at hauls and pages to see what else is out there. J Chelsea put up hers today, whoops, Chelsea Murray. Chelsea Jane Marie Calloran, she, she did a nice haul, so that was cool. I've got a few more things in my basket already. I wish I'm naughty. Um, but that'll wait till after, you know, I mean, I'm saying it'll wait till I have to pay, but it'll be next month now. I've still got, oh, I don't know, 50, 60 quid of my bonus stuff. I don't know how much because I haven't looked. But we'll find out. I, I can have a look, I just got to go in and yeah there's lots going on so happy days I love colouring I just love it Jennifer was colouring today she was colouring in her PJ masks colouring book 
she loves PJ masks. Because you're Spider Man, she's got Spider Man coming, a Marvel look. <laughs> Dinosaurs. She's like me, she gets interested in everything and she obsesses over it. She's very like me in that way. And she gets the idea into her head and she's got a, she just wants to know about it and watch it. And mostly it's watching um, videos about it at the moment. Eventually, I'm sure it'll turn to the same sort of thing I do, which is reading everything that you, she can find about it, watching documentaries about it rather than the fun videos that the kids make. But she does love them, which is great. As long as she's happy. And as long as she's having fun, I I'm happy. So is that part of the coral there? Or is that part of the rock? Or is it another rock? I think it's another rock. Sometimes it's hard to tell. But then again, it doesn't really matter. I'll just do it as part of, the ro of a rock. trying to sort out my supplies and get everything organized so that I can film um, my complete coloring collection so all my supplies all my books and so on and I'll probably split it into two or three videos the the supplies because I've got pens I've got markers and gel pens I've got watercolors acrylic paints Glitter jig glues, I've got normal pencils, I probably do normal colouring pencils as one, potentially markers as another maybe, I don't know, markers and gel pens as another and then miscellaneous supplies as another which will be like watercolours, acrylics and stuff like that. I think we'll do it like that. I haven't decided yet, but I think so. So I'm just going to do these a slightly. Oops, that's the wrong end. I never, very rarely use a chisel tip. I always use a nib or the brush if it's a brush marker. These are nibs and I don't mind these. I like the brush markers on the pastel set. They're really nice. Pastel set, but Oh dear me. So I had my car serviced and he did a full service which was oil change, new oil filter and everything. He comes back and the car starts beeping at me when I go for a long drive. Now I did this last time when the oil filter needed changing. So I know it's not that because he's done it. So it's quite funny really just to see what uh, he's done. He's got it and he's bringing it back with me tomorrow for shopping. If not. I can't even borrow my dad's because my dad's car's not working either. So, okay. He said he'll bring it back by 12 as long as there's nothing wrong in there for to work on it throughout the day. This poor bucket doesn't get a Sunday. He's so busy. He is constantly rammed with work. He's such a nice bloke though. Good mate. That pink's a bit bright. Clash with her air. Oh, you're right. So yeah, I'm looking forward to another good month of colouring in July. Though we're not at the end of June yet, and you know I colour right up to the end of the month. It might be a bit earlier this this month because I'm busy, very very busy next week, so I might not have time to film after Monday. So it might go up on Tuesday or Wednesday. Might not have time to colour much either. So. But that's okay. It's the way it is. I'm happy. so hot if you can hear the fan I do apologize if it's interrupting if it's causing any trouble 
It's so, so hot. <laughs> I am boiling. Even though it's not that hot now. And it's very, been very grey. The sun has been out. I managed to get a load of washing dry. And I just feel so hot and bothered. But it's not the end of the world. I like colouring at night when everybody's asleep. Um, it's just nice. I just sit in the spare room, the library, and colour. Sometimes I fall asleep in here. It's just nice. Oops. And we just see what happens. You know, oh, God, that's a nice cool breeze on me. <sighs> Every now and again. <laughs> I haven't read much towards the end of the month. I've read a few books this month, but not much. And I know I didn't do a wrap-up last month, so I'll do a combined one, so it'll be even longer. I will do it, but that will be towards the end of next week, beginning of the week after. It's because I lost my notebook. Oh, God. I found it again now. So now I've found that book, I can do it. And I'll also do the Jack the Ripper giveaway. So I do apologise if you've entered that I haven't done it. I've just been really bad. I'll try and do it as soon as possible. I like this book actually. Mind you, I like all of these Eve Brown books and the Chibis and the Kawaii's. I think. Whereas before it wasn't my kind of thing, now it really is. I really love it. really do. But your tastes change um, the more you colour. So I used to start out just doing people and they were realistic looking people even if they were witches and fairies they looked human. And, and then I started colouring on patterns as well. Interiors are still something I'm not as bothered about but I can do them. They're all right. And then I started getting into the cutesy things like Hannah Lynn and all that, so yeah, I'm really, really, and it does, it changes and the more you colour, the more you want to try different styles of artwork. I was never into grayscale, it always intimidated me, now I love it. Um, this and the Jade Summer Grayscale are really, really good. Um, and then some of the heavier dark grey scales such as in um, our gothic, the gothic alchemy one that the current heaven put out. That I would, I literally thought no, never. I mean it's gorgeous as it is but then I thought oh, come on why not. And I've done some in markers and some in pencils and they both look really nice. So I can't wait to do some more in there actually. I do want to do some more. It's just it is time consuming. But uh, I will try again. And I'm going to try again. With some more grayscale. But, uh, let's just turn. I'm, I do apologize that I'm turning it like this. I like to be able to see on the screen. Oops. I know it's very close to her hair colour, but then she'd blend in, wouldn't she? Doing a lot of mermaids lately, because the one in Metamorphia is mermaids in it. And normally mermaids aren't my thing. Fairies are alright, I prefer like witches and stuff. So, there you go. Oh, this is terrible, I just can't. I can't keep it straight. I don't know what is wrong with me today.
Oh, Jennifer's been having a lovely time playing with the little girl next door. She loves it a bit. So you're so sweet. And yeah, Sienna's two years older than her. Sienna's five. And Jennifer's only just, you know, she's three and a half now nearly. But they get on so well and they play together so well. But if, like, Sienna's in the hot tub and Jen don't want to go in the hot tub, Jennifer would quite happily play with the toys on the grass on her own. She's a sweet, she just likes being next door. Which is great, and they are nice. Really nice people, which is great. I only had one order this weekend, so I'll get that sorted. Post it Monday morning. So, we'll take her to nursery. Oh, I'm getting tired. I'll go to bed soon, I think. Cute, no, this girl. Yeah. There are a few books I'm looking at ordering that I haven't got that I want, but there's just so much. I mean, I think I've got over 300 books. It's got to be. I've got 100 Jade Summers. I mean, I know I don't really count my PDFs, even though they are books. But yeah, definitely over 300, it's got to be. And if it's not, it's got to be very close. I'll count them when I do my complete uh, collection which will be coming up I'll probably film that next week if I get a chance to do filming so we might not get a colour and chat next week but Excuse me. Turn the book down, so it's easier for me, not for you. There is so much I want. I want those pastel low ones. Um, they're not called that, but that's what people call them. They're really nice looking pencils. I've just got to change my battery, so excuse the wibbly wobbly. I'm sorry, I don't know what happened there, but I'm on the sea now. Something happened, I've been chatting away and it just switched itself off. I'm not sure whether it recorded any of it or not because it, I just don't know. Um, yeah, it normally lasts for 30 minutes, but some 30 minutes, but for some reason it stopped after a few. If of course it recorded, I don't actually know. So I do apologise. I was just saying about doing my colouring book collection, so I do apologise if I'm repeating myself. Um, but rather than do one long big video, I'm going to do it in sections, so we'll get something like... I'm going to do the um, books I haven't coloured in at all first. That'll be um, two to three videos because I've got a load of Jade Summer. Some colour in Heavens though, not that many. Some Hannah Carlson, some Maria Trelay, a lot of Creative Haven. So I'll try and group them like that, make it about a half hour to 45 minute video. And then I'm going to group them in artists. So all the Creative Haven will go, all, all companies, all the Colour in Heaven, all the Hannah Lynn, all the Hannah Carlsons. They'll all go together and we'll work it like that. Um, so we're going to do completed pages first. No, no, sorry. Books I haven't coloured in first, followed by whips and PDFs. Followed by... The other books I haven't coloured in, so that will be Colour in Heaven, Hannah Carlson, Maria Trollet, Selena Fennec, stuff like that. When we've done all the books I haven't coloured in at all, 
which I think is going to be three to four videos, possibly three, hopefully three, I will then do the books I have coloured in and the completed pages within those books. And again, we'll start with Jade Summer, then there'll be Colour in Heaven, then there'll be groups of, of artists like, say, Hannah Lynn, Selena Fennec, Deborah Muller, and so on, until we get through them all. I want them to be around 30 minutes to 45 minutes, no longer. So, and what we'll do is we'll keep a tally of, of what books I've got and how many I've got. Fortunately, when you buy from Amazon, if you buy a book on there and you click on it again, it tells you you've already bought this. Because you purchased this on such and such a date. And you're like, well, I don't need that one again then. <laughs> there are so many. So many books. I'm, I guess I must have about 300 or more. But we'll find out. There's something I really want to know. And my problem is, I'm not going to stop ordering them. That's the problem. I'm not going to stop getting them because they, they keep bringing out books I want. I've got two pre-orders already. I have two pre-orders and... Oh God, what was that? Two pre-orders and... Um, already and there are still more I want that are already out there's loads I want that are out that I haven't got so I want to get Jasmine Beckett Griffiths I want more Christina Caron or Christine Caron I want more colouring chicks now I've just given a clue what's in my haul this month and I want I want I want I want I sound like Jennifer I just love colouring books and I love oh I want the April Amber unicorns I haven't got it so on Chelsea's channel I knew it was out, but I hadn't seen the pictures, but I really want it. There's more yam puff I haven't got. Oh, there's just too many, just too many colouring books in the world. And it's not fair, because I want them all. Well, not them all. I don't do the ones with swearing in. I don't do the ones with Bible verses in, because I'm not particularly religious. Well, I'm not religious. Um, but um, I'm not particularly into cars. I, I don't mind if there's an image with a car. I'll quite happily colour it, but... There's certain things I don't like colouring, which I wouldn't pick up. But there's lots of stuff I really do like. So I know the new colour in heaven looks good. As a subscriber, I get what's called a sneak peek video. Um, I didn't colour that in. I left that for some reason. It's part It's part of the water, is it? Or is it a... It's part of the water. It's got to be. Yeah. I've got no idea what that is either. It, part of a top, part of a wall, oh, just part of the wall. Oh, it looks a bit weird, but hey. Yeah, it's one of those things where it's like, I haven't covered that in. It's not skin. It doesn't look like it should be all body. So, I don't know. It, um, I like this book. <laughs> so, yeah, there's just too many books coming out all the time that I want, so. Back in a minute, I've got to go and do something. I need a drink and I didn't bring it over. No. <laughs> well, that's better, I needed that drink anyway. It's my own fault for not bringing it over. Okay, there we go. So, what are you colouring, guys? Are you alright? So, are you colouring anything? Exciting, you've got anything really new and good that you want to share with the group? <laughs> Sounds like school, doesn't it? Andrea, do you have something you want to share with the group? No, sir. <laughs> well, I know we all got the halls and everything, but is there a supplier you found that you really has changed your colour in? The way you feel about it? For better or worse? I'll turn this way now so I can do up here. You know, is there, is there anything? Because I want to know. I mean, is there anything you would recommend that I haven't got? Um, you can see pretty much everything I've got on uh, previous haul videos and completed uh, complete um, supplies that I put up brief previously. So, you know. Mm. 
so warm in here. Mind you, saying that I have got the lamp on because it helps with lighting the picture when I'm colouring it. It's a great big photographic lamp. It's not a small ring light. I'm thinking of getting a ring light for my camera, which would be more directed directly onto the page, but it works. So it's what I use for photographing my eBay stock. So why would I spend more money on something when I got something that works? It just makes me so hot. It does. Now I will say that I do love these markers and I will buy them again at some point because they are so nice. I might get the brush ones. I don't know yet. I'll have to have a look. Because there's so many different types you can get. And I, I do like them. I like the brush ones because the pastel ones, the pastel ones are brush with ones. And I like them. So. Getting there slowly. Oh, I've still got a huge stack of whips under my desk. It's getting bigger. It's not getting any smaller, you know. I have got to do some of them though. I've got to get rid of them. Because it's just taking up so much space that I could be using for other things. <laughs> I don't know if you're enjoying me watching colour in the background. <laughs> I'm not really saying very much. Have I seen anything lately that's worth mentioning? I was talking about um, Lightning Top. That's a really good channel um, where I have like weird unexplained things like 10 unexplainable archaeological finds or the 12 best um, sunken ships or something like that. It's actually quite fascinating. There's a bit of history on whatever it is the subject is for the week. There's so many good channels. Fascinating Horror, Lazy Masquerade, they're really good ones. Slapped Ham is a good one. If you like weird things. There's quite a few uh, movie related ones that I watch. Some some specifying, you know, specifically about Marilyn Monroe or Judy Garland. Um, there's a Gene Harlow one as well now, which I've started watching. So that's really cool. Yeah, I love it. I'm loving it. All this stuff. Yeah, there we go. Um, I pulled all the videos, well, videos, all the DVDs of films that I haven't watched off the shelves in the living room, ready for me to start watching movies. So, there is a DVD player in the caravan when we go on a holiday in a few weeks. I might take a couple down. I don't know yet. I'll wait and see. I don't know. Happy days. I'm getting too hot for this. I'm going to have to stop soon. No wonder the fans turn to me around when I went to get a drink. <laughs> so I went downstairs to get something fresh. Oh, silly mummy. I was doing this naughty mummy. I was like, I've done anything wrong, Jennifer? Why am I naughty? Naughty mummy. Okay. She is so funny. She's been so good this week. I've got to be honest, she's been a good girl. We bought her a scooter this week, so look out for footage of that in the, in the, in the weekly vlog on Monday. 
was quite funny. Oh, I love her. She's so sweet. It's just, what do you do with a kid like that? She's just, she, she's getting, she was playing on it yesterday and she, she didn't go on it today. But she is getting to grips with it now because I got it Thursday. She had to go Thursday and she had to go last night and she's getting with it now. So she just needs to practice really. something new for it to learn I like this mermaid, she's so cute. So my, my, my goal is to still, I, I mean I don't really have goals in the sense that people have these bullet journals and I did think about it once but I never do it so it's a waste of money so I thought no. I, I, I even writing it down, I've got a diary and I never write in it, I haven't written in it for weeks. I think I've did it at the beginning of the month, it's now the end. So I will have to start doing it again then. It's just I don't like to have to be reliant and you know, and I don't like to be to certain things you know you've got to do this on this day I've got to do this by the date um, I like to be able to do what I want because obviously my work life's quite structured I have to be there at a certain time start at a certain time you take your breaks I don't, I don't obviously but because I only work part time you take your breaks at a certain time you you know and things like that that when it comes to like colouring it's supposed to be fun not a chore and I thought if I set myself too many high goals I wouldn't enjoy it anymore so I do try and colour in a couple of books I haven't coloured in every month. I colour in as many of the new books as I get as I, I can. It doesn't always work. So for instance, like with the Ava Brown PDFs, they, they release them almost every week. I don't know if they, I don't think they're doing one this week. Um, and some of them, they're not my particular kind of thing. I might really love the pictures, but they, it's something I've got to be in the mood for. So I don't, I just leave a review on Amazon for those, do the ones I really like. And from that I just um yeah you, do you know what I mean it's hard to, to explain it I don't like thought I've got to colour in five books I haven't coloured in I've got to colour in one Hannah Lynn one Selena Fennec two Jade Summers it's got to be what I want to colour I've got to feel it so I mean I'm quite happy to do one or two buddy colours a month but not loads because I think I'd get overwhelmed by I've got to do this I've got to do this by this date and, I, and then I won't enjoy it so I did the one with Chelsea I did one with Chelsea this month and hopefully we'll be doing the one next month and I really enjoyed doing that one it was really nice so I really enjoyed that so me and her are going to do another one in one of the Jade Summer books next month which will be nice and then yeah, I'm quite happy to do it so if you do want to do a buddy colour with me let me know and let me know what book you want to do it in if I've got the book we'll do that don't pick anything too complicated if you don't want it done quite quick though <laughs> so So we nearly finished this and I'll just put a little bit of sparkle on her and then that'll be it and she'll be done. Another completed page. But I, I do like this style, it's nice and simple with markers. I've got plenty of complex books um, like the Kirby Rosanis, the Nick Filbert, 
I've got the Hannah Carlson's, the Johanna Basford's stuff for pencils. So with this, it is nice to break out the markers and just not worry too much about it. Just put colour down and then a bit of glitter and you're all done. I kind of like that, so it makes me happy. And that's what it's about. It doesn't matter if you go out the lines or you make a mistake. It's supposed to be fun. Absolutely, it's supposed to be fun and it's supposed to be relaxing. And if you're worrying too much, it's not relaxing. If I get bored of page, I put it down. That's why I've got so many whips. Some of them need backgrounds and I'm like, oh, I'm afraid of ruining it. Or I'm afraid of it looking rubbish. Or it's, it needs, I, I gotta do some more colouring on something and I'm like, I can't be bothered. And that's just me being lazy. But there will come a time I think, right, I really wanna finish that picture, let's get it out and do some. And I've got one like that on the go. But it's getting to the point where I really wanna colour it. So that's gonna be, probably finish off the beginning of next month. I'd love to get the, I'd love to get the Nick Filbert whip finished and that literally just needs a little bit of work and a background it's practically done it's just because of the background I want to use I'm terrified of it but you can't really ruin anything can you oh really Right, nearly finished and we'll just get a bit of sparkle on her tail and her top and then maybe a little bit in her hair as well there we go oh, I love it another drink when this is finished I usually have one over here but I just haven't got it it's on the nightstand Yeah. <laughs> Love it. Glitter. I'll put those away in a minute. Where's glitter pens? There is some, I've seen them earlier. Here they are. I've got so many bags with pens in it. And I got these in a touch new 80 piece bag because the, the, uh, um, the link shines, and I've got thousands of link shines. I've got, look, look at this. <laughs> They're all link shines because I like them so much. And, uh, yeah, I do like them. I like them a heck of a lot, I'm not going to lie. Um, so, um, I'm just going to put a bit around here. Around her top. A little bit of glitter. And a little bit on her tail. a lot on this because it is grey scale and we'll just do a few of her bits of scales here and there I'll do a lot and then we'll put some in her hair as well I love using glitter and I do love gel pens. I do have stickles, as you know. I do use them, but I'm not a big fan because they're quite a raised sub substance, so you have to be careful if you want to do something on the other page that you're going to have a lump. There we go. And there she is. There is our little mermaid. Our aerial is all finished. So 
I do hope you've enjoyed this colour and chat. It's been a lot longer and there's not a lot of chatting really, but I do hope you've enjoyed it. And I will see you very soon in the next video. Thanks everybody. Bye now. Have a drink.